Hello friends, today I will discuss about use of earth oil in transmission line. Earth oil in a transmission line is located in the top of the transmission tower. Uh, normally, nowadays, optical fiber ground wire is used uh, as a earth oil. It provides shielding effect uh, to the conductor from direct lighting, that is, it protects uh, lightning in, uh, from the con phase conductor. Now, a diagram has been shown for a 132 kb double circuit line. Here, earth wire is located at the top of the tower and it provides a protection angle or its shield angle to the phase conductor as shown in this diagram. Since earth wire provides shield to the phase conductor, sometimes it is called shield wear. Now, if the uh, span between phase to phase conductor is more, then instead of one earth wire, there are two earth wire is used in transmission tower. Here a single circuit, uh, 400 kb uh, single circuit tower has been shown in this diagram. Here two earth wire is used two earth wire, how the shield effect is uh, provided by two earth wire has been shown in this diagram. Normally the shielding angle uh, is varies from 25 to 30 degree. Now, what is the purpose of the uh, other purpose of the earth, earth wire? Uh, beside uh, from uh, protecting from direct lighting to the phase conductor, it, prov it provides the return path for the any earth fault occur in any phase. That is, for example, R phase to ground uh, fault occur due to class hour of insulator, for example, uh, red phase. Uh, then, due to class hour, uh, zero seconds current flow from the red phase to tower body and tower body via earth wire and via earth wire, uh, the current will flow from the nearby substation. Thereby, it provides the return part for the uh, any phase to earth or phase to ground fault. Now how the earth wire provides a return path for the any phase to ground fault has been shown in this diagram. Here are two substation located, uh, substation A and substation B located at one end and substation B located at another end. And uh, if any fault occur, that is fault current is IF, the fault current will be divided in two paths that is IFA towards the substation A and IFB towards substation B. Now, IFA will be transmitted via earth wire to the ground of the substation A and return via uh, neutral of the transformer and via R phase. Similarly, IFB is transmitted via uh, ground of the earth wire and uh, return via neutral of the transformer via rate phase as shown in this diagram thereby IF is equal to IFA plus IFB. Any, any transient fault occur due to tree touching in any phase to earth, same earth fault current is divided via uh, ground uh, to the uh, tower body to the earth wire. That is uh, first uh, the current will flow from the tree to the ground and it is divided uh, by two part that is uh, two tower nearby two tower ifa is uh, transmit towards the tower footing resistance to the tower body to the earth wire and it will transmit uh, via uh, nearby substation that is uh, substation a to the uh, ground neutral uh, of the transformer and via bottom conductor Similarly, IFB will be transmitted by a tower body to the earth wire and via substation B in neutral of the transformer and via bottom phase of the conduct conductor. Thereby, uh, the secondary uh, use of the earth wire is to provide the return part for any phase to earth fault. As the earth wire optical fiber ground wire is used, uh, in the outside, uh, it provides uh, direct protection from lightning to the phase conductor and also provide the return path for the any phase to uh, ground fault. And the function of optical fiber is uh, it uh, provides the digital communication 
uh, for carrier communication um, that is in the distance rail located in the uh, both end of the substation if any uh, fault occur uh, sensed by the distance relay that is zone 1 carrier will be sent from the distance relay and same analog signal is tra uh, transformed to the digital signal via digital production coupler and same signal is transmitted via optical fiber to the far end substation and in the far end substation the digital production coupler again uh, transform the digital signal to the analog signal and it is received to the distance rail located at the far end that is carrier received by the far end substation 21 or distance relay that is carrier communication is done by optical fiber the, what are the conclusion conclusion number one it provides shield to the phase conductor of the transmission line if uh, the span between the face to face conductor is more that is horizontal span is more then instead of one arthur two arthur is used that is mainly um, uh, voltage above 400 kV instead of one two arthur is provided it provides the return path for any phase to earth fault occur in the transmission line Number three is carrier signal is transmitted via optical fiber. Number four is apart from the carrier signal transmit, it provides the telecommunication voice signal trans transmission by OFC that is optical fiber cable.